Okay, welcome viewers. I'm Lachlan, Lloyd, Dino, Maxi. I call this a verting narrow bowls. We are literally a mat width from the ditch. There's a jack up behind where the camera is at the present. And what I'm saying to the boys, I want you to draw within a mat length of the jack and not go in the ditch. Because what happens, people, play narrow. Now these ditches will have a tendency to do that. So your focus, the focus of the three boys, we've got two left-handers and a right-hander. We should even get another right-hander in. Um, and, and let's just see what they do. Prime object, not to be narrow. Secondary object, be within mat length of the ditch. Okay, let's do the two left-handers first. And right -hand. One of you boys want to come over with two bowls and just be the then? Yep. Would you do me a favour and just push bowls out of the way, sir? Okay. Thanks. So here we go. Max is... Well done, Max. He well, stayed on, right. but he's probably about a metre over. <coughs> As I said, the whole purpose of this exercise is trying to get people to uh, stop bowling narrow. How are you looking? But you've stayed wide. Yeah. In fact, Oh, no. oh. <laughs> great bowl, great bowl. Right, our dinner. So with the left hand, it's just their forehand, obviously. It's going to be backhand for the two backhands. Ah, now our left-handed coach is in the ditch. Now it's interesting to make sure don't repeat the same error. <laughs> He's gone wider. And it'll swing now. So I like that. I can see he's gone wider, so can he, and more importantly, he stayed on the playing surface. Now we've got two right-handers, Lloyd, so it'll be backhand here. Lloyd's gone very wide. Nothing wrong with that, because he knows what to alter. Much better bowl. And you watch it work now. Pretty good. Yep, Good. Yeah. And Danny's going to be our last one. Also gone wide. I don't mind the caution. Yeah, doesn't it? What? And now it's his last bowl. Yeah. Happy with that? Just while that filming on the jack, another way you could do that is push the jack right on the very edge of the ditch and say to the players, I want you to make sure your bowl stays on the green. Because for me, people who constantly repeat narrow bowls need to have some way of highlighting. When that bowl goes in the ditch, they need to have it hit home. You're narrow, you're narrow, you're narrow. So thanks boys very much for that. And we've got one more film clip to go, Colin. Thanks.